So now the question is um, whether we can borrow some visuals from Visible Girls uh, at minimum cost. Or maybe if we spent the £500 for technical support on recreating that somehow, with permission, whatever that would cost, we'd have um, the £2,000 we could offer it to Tech Exeter or Collider or somebody who knows about these things to recreate a studio. Um, it might be enough to buy a, buy a mixing desk and borrow the computers from somewhere else. I don't know. Uh, any any ideas on this? Uh, I'm sort of going to do this as Rougemont Global Broadcasting for for a while, but JD, please please think about this, and uh, we'll have to submit something by Sunday the 13th of December, and then there's just the remote possibility an interview on the 21st of December. So JD, if you could be ready for that. Because uh, I won't be an extra then. And then we've got to do everything complete by the 29th of January. So I, I think this is just re, re, an outside sort of thing we could just think about. And um, if if we get any feedback, we could repurpose it with our, our plays about walking about in Exeter, looking at where the CD shops used to be and the other ones. And um, we'll just see what space might be available and what technology we can get hold of at different points.